Hi Aries, Gwen here to do a refocus reading. I've got my Animal Wise Tarot deck today and I'm, I've drawn one card for each one of the signs and this is going to be your power animal to help you refocus dur during this highly transformational time of ascension. Okay, like this month is everything that's going on with the planets, the retrogrades, the trines, the... the <laughs> Whatever, you know, like all this, the solar flares, the solar energy, you know, and then this immense um, energy gateway opening this lion's gate that happens every year. But there's a beautiful super moon in August as well. So Leo season, man, there's some, some transformation in times. And so I wanted to come on and at least give you one, one card. Okay. And we'll talk a little bit about the animal. So. Remember to reach out to me if you want your own personal private reading. This one's just general. Tago resonates and leave the rest. I do have a sale on my readings right now. $33 make you holla. So reach out to me. Um, you can follow me on Facebook or Instagram. I'm Mystic Gwen. You can message me that way or you can email me. I love you guys. Okay. So Aries, you got a major arcana out for your, for your message. It's the whale. Oh, yeah, it's the whale. Seriously, the judgment card. Card 20. Okay, realize that in a tarot deck, we've got 21 major arcanas and you're on number 20 here. So an ending is in sight, an ending, the old, a shedding an old way, uh, ending an, an old life and starting a new one. This, the whale speaks to rebirth, darling. And that's, it's a, this is a beautiful part of your awakening where your creative abilities are going to be super enhanced creative expression okay singing your old your own soul song because the the whales especially the baleens like the humpback communicates through song the male sings a different song each year okay and so it's about speaking now too like yes our words are powerful when they're written down but when we actually speak them into existence with resonance and with power, then it, it, you know, it is drawn into our life, uh, in my opinion, quicker. So your song, sing your own soul song is a big message from the whale. And it tells me that, you know, the, the whale dives down deep, you know, so you've been doing some shadow work. You've been doing, you know, digging in deeper into some of these. I mean, we've got Chiron retrograde bringing up old past traumas to see if we, you know, healed or do we need to, you know, have more compassion, more forgiveness moving forward, right? So, um, new depths of creativity, okay? Not creating just to create for, for creation's sake, but, but a depth of creation that's coming out of you, a deeper soul song, because you've been like when you get card 20 in the major arcana but that that's like about duality that's like getting a wake-up call think about like when the whale comes up out of that enormous creature coming out of the of the sea you know the force and the it's like awe-inspiring take your breath away right right so that's about the depths of creative creative creativity that i'm talking about for you all okay I'm, I'm going to make sure that I didn't forget anything in this beautiful book. Mm. Yeah. When whale appears, it's time to learn to create through sound. Our words will have great power. The songs of past endeavors will open doors to the future. Accomplishments right now. We, the whale reminds us we must adapt our song, our words, to the time and place. They should never be wrote. Whales have a form of sonar or echolation, further reinforcing the awakening creative power of our voice in, in all our endeavors, reinforcing our vision. Now is the time to trust our perceptions, for we are seeing more clearly a new vision is blessing our life in all areas. The, uh, to the in Inuit people, the whale was a gift of the great spirit and enabling them to survive. The appearance of whale always her heralds a time in which a great depth of creative energies is available to us. We should draw upon those creative energies now to make the changes we desire in any area of our life. However, creativity for the sake of more creativity is not what the whale teaches. 
Whale promises greater depths of creative inspiration, but with practical expression. Only then does the creativity make our life more wondrous. Okay? And it's about resurrection in our own life as well. Come up out of the water like that? Like, seriously, shot babies. Okay, that's what I got for you today to, to refocus you. Okay? Tune into the whale energy. That's your power animal right now. It tells me that the Aries have been going through an emotional time. All the water there. It's time to trust your creative powers. Your self-expression, speak it into existence with power, Aries, right? Okay, sing your song. Yeah, absolutely. And trust your intuition with all that water there, okay? Wake up, sleeping beauties. Mwah. I love you. If it resonated, claim the reading. Drop an emoji down below. Um, very interesting that I've had a candle burning for these readings. <clears throat> Pardon me today and um, the candle just went out with your reading so yeah it's a brand new beginning you're just like on the precipice of coming through that water wow yay Aries I love that I love that because that was a candle where I was releasing old and for new to come in you know I believe in candle magic so maybe tune in to some candle magic as well since I am pointing it out and boy is that candle just that wick is still a smoldering so you could be <laughs> smoldering, brimming, brewing with <laughs> new creative expression. Well, I love you guys. I love you. Take care of you. Remember to reach out to me if you want your own reading. Um, and thank you, thank you, thank you for the good karma donations. It means the world to me. Thank you.